Perfect. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. All right, blows away. I want to. I want to see some fucking crazy stuff today. Oh shit, we're starting off with Tekken Eight. Oh what shit, it's Tekken. People like us shouldn't even exist in this world. I told you. That's pathetic words. Cause Cause I'm I'm fuck, look how fucking realistic that looks. Whoa. Oh shit. Right in the gameplay. Wow. Oh my god, this is Tekken 7, but way better looking. Oh Jesus, Tekken's got the same fucking like muscle definition shit going on. Ooh. Good soundtrack. Oh, he's pissed. <laughs> What the fuck? Okay, so cinematic moments. Okay, this is story. This is story stuff. So it's cinematic moments mixed in with some gameplay elements. God damn, this looks good. I love it. Street Fighter and Tekken both going really realistic. Oh, fuck you. I am the one winged angel, bitch. <laughs> Did, did he just go, bitch? <laughs> Break the chain. Back in eight. What the fuck? That looks good. Stay tuned. So Tokyo Game Show, we're going to see even more. All right. All right. The teaser for Tokyo it's Game official. Show. We're starting off Tekken good. Tekken 8 is coming to the PlayStation 5 console, courtesy of our battle-hardened friends at Bandai Namco Entertainment. Is it exclusive? Wow, if that now, was if let's that's check exclusive, in on two games man. in development for PlayStation Ooh, VR PSVR 2. 2. Man, if that is exclusive, that means Street Fighter 5 was exclusive. Now Street Fighter 6 is on everything. This time Tekken 8 is exclusive. Damn. The story I was telling, it was about a certain droid repair tech who had no business getting into this kind of trouble. But there they were. Standing against evil wherever it popped up. That's the voice from uh, uh, Jedi Fallen Order. I think there are a few new items on the shelves that might catch your eye. The old guy that's looking after Cal, or working with him, I should say. The locals can be a little rough on tourists, but yeah, it's, totally him. it's nothing you can't handle. What? The first order on Batuu. Surely we P3PO. can now. Oh. Hello, my friend. Wow, so it's like an on-the-rail shooter. It's awesome. Holy shit. PSVR 2 on-the-rail shooter, Star Wars? Hell yeah. I'm there. In development for next year. If, all right. Yep, everything's in development for next year. Ready for oh, battle. VR. Oh. Let all monsters beware. My aim is true. That's a good call. Make a, uh, a board Taste game. My steel. Is this Odd World? No, that's just a. Huh. That's a good call. A, a board a, a board game like that. Go back to the abyss. Is this like Dungeons and Dragons or something? Board game? You VR? Interesting. Dem Demio, 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 Demio. Hmm. I'm gonna turn this down just a little bit. Demio brings the creativity okay. and chaos of a tabletop RPG to PSVR 2. Okay, so it's like Dungeons and Dragons in VR. That's pretty. This next Sega. game is being rebuilt from the ground up and will be available outside of Japan for the first time. Oh fuck. Sega. <laughs> Fucking weird seeing Sega on a Sony press conference. Holy sh A lone samurai embarks on a secret quest for revenge and sparks the greatest revolution. Kenobi? 
Man with the sights on the future bullshit. This is Shinobi? Man stuck in the past? Another who was never supposed to exist in the first place? Look in the life of a man who's had two of them. Right? Sakamoto Ryoma san yo. It's Yakuza Man. Oh, so it's like, it's Yakuza. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Samurai, Shinobi, Yakuza. Okay. Huh. Oh. Huh. He was a cowboy samurai. Oh. Hello, Madam Mason. I understand you have a shop to sell. No. Oh. I think you will find my the Hogwarts quite generous. The, the Harley Pooper. What's the catch? You are wise to be wary. Why is your mistress selling the shop? She has had rotten bad mm. luck with the last few tenants. Those who came before you just could not seem to escape the darkness. Will you? Watch your step. Oh, it's a separate Harry Potter game. Hmm. Hmm. I'm getting the Harry Potter whatsoever at all, so I can't get hyped up for it. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Looks interesting. Cinematic footage from PC and PS5 gameplay footage. Huh. Oh, okay. I was looking very realistic for a second, and then it went all very artsy. <laughs> The Walking Dead. <laughs> Warning. Warning. An instability front is approaching. Take immediate shelter in a stabilized area. Locations impacted include sectors Delta and Echo. Sorry? Fudge monsters? Okay, so it's like a it's a survival uh free roam survival game. Oh no! You went a little too slippy slidey on the road. Another one? After all these years? Hmm. Caller. Now. Pacific Drive. I feel like I've heard of that title before. I feel like I've heard of that before. Pacific Drive. Hmm. I don't know where I've heard it, but I feel like I've heard it before. Survive a ride from hell in Pacific Drive. The debut game from Ironwood Studio. Yeah. <laughs> 
Up next, let's check in on PlayStation Stars, a loyalty program oh, rolling right. out soon. Yep. Oh, soon. Cool. Yeah, I think it's like Christmas time. So the more Hi, trophies everyone. you get, the I'm more. Grace Chen. Not long ago, we announced our brand new loyalty program called PlayStation Stars. Yep. It's designed to celebrate you, the players. It will be free to join PlayStation Stars. Very Crash Bandicoot As a member, you can complete various activities to earn points that can be redeemed for rewards. Digital collectibles are a highlight of the program. Uh -huh. These are digital representations of things that PlayStation fans love. Today, I'm pleased to give you a sneak peek at some examples of our digital collectibles. So I... Whether it's a beloved game character or a cherished device like really cool. innovative nice. history, there will always be something new to collect and show off to your friends. Is, remember how I was saying like uh, they should take and the PlayStation Museum and news. PlayStation Stars will begin to roll out in some regions in Asia and that's what this starting is. in late September. It will launch in the Americas and Europe in the weeks that follow. Really? That's it for now. Check PlayStation blog to learn more about cool. PlayStation so Stars. So by next month. Nice. Yeah, so it's like if, if you get a platinum trophy on a game, you get a little collectible figurine thing with it, which I think is actually really, really cool. Mech gameplay. Cinematic. Armored Core making a comeback? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The base builder or something, right? No, it is actually. Fuck it, anime mix, why not? You know? Wait. Wasn't there a mech game on the PSP or some shit? Is that what this is? Sin duality. Okay. You something brand new then. Okay. <laughs> Bandai Namco, of course it is. Holy fuck, man. We just got we got a trailer for Tekken 8. Action games are PS5 console exclusives. Let's take a look. Ooh. Okay. All right. This this could be the big thing. Sony Interactive Entertainment percent. Suddenly. Humanity has fallen so miserably. The on city of the abandoned. Peak, this was home to more than a thousand people. <laughs> Underneath the wasteland. Have we seen a tech demo of this before? Something I did. <laughs> Is this some kind of grave? No, people here are in a deep sleep due to energy depletion. This continues, it'll just be an eternal darkness. Eve, help us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we have seen this before. Um, little tech demos of it. It's looking pretty good. So I, mean, I remember seeing tech demos for this like two, three years ago. It just kind of started popping up on like YouTube and Twitter and everything. I was like, huh, interesting. I'm surprised they actually made it into a full prize. Oh, 
a lot of flippy dippy action. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Stella Blade. Okay. Yep. Project Eve saw that. Like I said, I think it was like 2018, 2019, something like that. I saw that. Hmm. Boy Tecmo. Eighteen sixty three, Japan. Oh, sh after three centuries of the Tokugawa's repressive rule, the black ships of Ghost of Tsushima, too, and our it? nation began to tear itself apart. Those who cleave to the past, those who embrace the new, hey. and the Ronin, a warrior free of all masters and bonds. That's Jin, isn't it? Or what the fuck? This looks like Assassin's Creed. I will watch over you all as your blades carve a new future. This, this is totally Ghost of Tsushima too. Has to be. Your time has come. Rise as one. Oh, Rise of the Ronin. I wonder if it's... I was going to say, because Koei Tecmo didn't make Ghost of Tsushima. That was Sucker Punch. I mean, it's basically Ghost of Tsushima. <laughs> the comment section are going to fucking kill me over Experience that. Experience an era Sucker Punch. Great change and upheaval in Rise of the Ronin, a sprawling action RPG from Team Ninja. It's got to be the same voice actor. It, it sounds up, super familiar, though, for you. If, it, if it's not. Hmm. I'll definitely check it out. Koei Tecmo, Rise of... Oh, shit, God of War. Here we go. Here's some new gameplay, and this is the controller to go with it. Boy. <laughs> it looks kind of cool. Sure. I wouldn't mind picking it up. Oh, shit. We actually do get a full-on trailer. Everyone keeps secrets. Sometimes it's the only way to protect the ones we love. The blades. Kratos is fucking done with this shit. <laughs> I'm too old for this I shit. Know. God killer. What is it you want from me? Is it a god of war you came to find? You don't really want war, do you, Kratos? All that blood on your hands. In your son's hands. What is it you will not tell me? I can't talk about it, but I just need you to trust me. We follow your every whim. But you don't believe in any of it. And still, I follow. Because <laughs> all that matters is that you are safe. But that's not all that matters. Who's keeping you safe? I do not need you to protect me. You sure about that? Pretender God! Oh god, the Valkyries are back. When it burns me. What do you even know of God's work? In your lifetimes, has anyone ever worshipped you? Ever prayed to you? Can you even imagine that kind of love? No! 
You don't care about anything beyond yourself. Beyond the monster who kills without cause. Damn, is he talking to Atreus or is he talking to Kratos there? That could go either way. What? Underwater stuff too? Fuck. Oh, shit. The Fate giant. only binds you if you let it. Hoop for the moon, boy. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Okay. All right. Kratos getting making some friends. That was Thor. We'll make our own destiny. Oh shit! That's the first look at Thor. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And that's the show. God of War Ragnarok comes to PS5 yeah. and PS4 on November 9th. See you next time. Okay. That was, uh, I count three pretty big trailers in there. Three, three pretty massive trailers in there. That Tekken trailer. Holy shit, man. That was cool. Um, but yeah. Uh huh. That's right. We stay for the PlayStation logo around here. Um, okay. PlayStation stay at play. Tekken look great. Um, Rise of the Ronin. Uh, if that wasn't the same dude who plays Jin, that sounded very close and similar to it. I mean, that game, Koei Tecmo just is, uh, was it Koei Tecmo? Jeez. Um, they are just making like a, wh wh whoever that the studio is making it, uh, they're making a fucking Ghost of Tsushima type of game. But Ghost of Tsushima is like Assassin's Creed. So is it more Assassin's Creed or is it more Ghost of Tsushima? Assassin's Creed Japan is about to have so much competition. Holy shit, man. They're, they're about to have a ton of competition because there is going to be probably like three games set and fuel Japan out next year and everybody's going to be losing their shit because they're all going to be Ronins and Samurais and Ninjas and oh my. <laughs> yeah. um, God of War, of course. That seeing the look on, of uh, of Thor right there. Awesome. Big man Thor. Uh, it's, I just watched Thor Love and War or whatever the hell it is there. Love and Thunder uh, last night and it was like, eh, eh. So... I could really use a good, th solid Thor adventure. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, not exactly what I was looking for. Uh, here's a weird one. So this was supposed to be a Japanese showcase. That was Sony Santa Monica. <laughs> that was not Japan. But we did get the the Tekken 8 Japan stuff. So uh, overall, uh, you know, I, I liked it. I like the state of play. We got some really cool stuff. Had some oh shit moments in there. That's exactly what you're looking for. PlayStation delivered once again. Nice.